help. Uh, you have actually now understood this whole part, this whole section. Going downwards, there is a camera part. So for the camera, <coughs> let us try to run this again and I'll show you what I mean. When we start editing the camera, the camera attributes. So now, right now, you guys can see that the distance from the camera to the character herself is not that huge. And yeah, as you can see, the camera is sort of like, can we say, like one meter or 1.5 meters from the character. And it's viewing at an angle of around, of it can view up to like 120 degrees. So once you come, let us go into the camera object. So into the camera object, um, there is a distance adjustment. There is a camera position delay, camera rotation delay, field of view, uh, camera collision, object transparency, and um, elevate height right from the ground upwards it's a hundred centimeter that's like one meter and i think i'm not wrong camera transformation spring um transformation camera mode we are also going to tackle this and perspective mode and also graphic mode all right let us first start with the distance adjustment so this is the distance from which the camera is with regards to the character let us try to make this uh, 20 save and run so okay so right now as you can see the distance from the character to the camera is has become quite small it's just one it's just 20 centimeters really small let us make it 400 and then run so now you can see that um, the distance from the character to the camera has become quite long it's actually ridiculous this is really long but it's looking quite all right anyways so let us stop this and then go back set it back to okay let's make it 250 that's a, that's a better position enable camera position delay so once you toggle on enable camera delay let us first understand it in practice once the character is turning, the, the, the camera doesn't turn right away, but then it delays a little bit. And then once the character stops, the camera also doesn't stop. It has sort of like the inertia. So as you can see, the character, once the, the player, the, once the character stops, the camera sort of continues to come closer to the character, you know, that sort of thing. So the character, once the character starts moving, the, car, the camera sort of stays behind for a, for a moment. And once the character stops, the camera pulls over to the character. That's what I meant. Let's stop that. Okay. Camera still. And then uh, the camera rotation delay. This is what we just tackled let us remove this so that is camera position delay field of view now okay so you guys i think you remember the image of how it was looking let us try to make it like uh, let's make it gigantic so that you can see a difference like the field of view being 150 something degrees it makes everything really wide for the wide angles really wide okay this is what i meant so you can see that the character sort of goes quite far 
and you are actually seeing a lot of stuff inside a small screen it's quite funny but yeah Okay, this can actually give you vertigo. <laughs> oh my god. Everything is so distorted. There's nothing that is actually in the right order. There's nothing in the right place. Very terrible. So this is what we mean by field of view. The field of view is uh, the angle at which what stuff are being seen so this one the more you go up the more it's wide and the more it goes down the more it's like a portrait sort of a sort of feel let us run let us run this and then you can see okay so i think you guys can actually understand what we are what we've done with the with the camera we changed its um, the distance it's wide angle i mean angle of uh, field of view to a very lower one let's make it 40 it's more it, it became more of a portrait sort of um, angle field of view okay so you can see we are now closer to the character and uh, we are actually seeing very few things inside our screen it's just straightforward 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 nothing much